Friday, medyo maingay yung aso, no? Tutuloy pa ba natin itong video shoot? Ayan, no? Sir Alan, the show must go on. Well, you have a point. Okay, so, um, in this video, I am going to show you the new Facebook Messenger Rooms. So, stay tuned. You're watching Alan Online TV, the place to be if you want to build your online brand, business, and be your own boss. Now your host, Alan Alino. Hi, si Alan De Leon to, and welcome to Alan Online TV. Now, if you are new to my channel and you would like to learn mga online strategies, mga online tools that you can use to grow your online brand, online business, and be your own boss, then mag-subscribe ka na at i-click mo na rin yung bell notification so you won't miss any of our video tips, tricks, and tutorials. Dahil sa COVID-19 pandemic, syempre tayo ay nasa loob ng ating bahay. Of course, may lockdown, may ECQ, may GCQ. So, ang means natin to communicate sa outside world is through video conferencing. Yan. So, usong-uso itong mga software na to. At ang number one software for video conferencing is Zoom. Yes, ang Zoom. But unfortunately for Zoom, nagkaroon siya ng mga security issues to the point na may mga bansa na binan siya totally, ayaw na siyang gamitin. So ngayon, nagkaroon ng opportunity si Facebook gumawa ng kanyang sariling video conferencing and this is called Messenger Rooms. Now, kung ito'y ni-roll out na, itong Messenger Rooms. Ngayon, kung hindi mo pa alam at hindi mo alam kung nasaan yan sa Messenger mo at hindi mo pa nakita, well, itong video na to, ipapakita ko sa'yo kung saan mo mahanap yan at kung paano mo gagamitin. So, kung ready ka na, let's head over sa computer screen ko para ipakita ko sa'yo. Okay, you're ready? Come on, let's go! So here we are sa computer screen ko. Yang nakikita nyo ngayon, yan ang aking Facebook profile. So gagawa tayo ng messenger room. So ang gagawin mo lang is punta ka mismo dito sa may messenger mo. Then baba ka dito sa see all in messenger. Mas gusto natin mas malaki para mas madaling makita yung button ng messenger room. So dito na tayo. Here we go. So, usually akong ginagawa ko pag gumagamit ako ng video call dito sa messenger, ito yung button na kiniklik ko. Kung voice call lang, then this one. Now, where can you find the messenger room button? Then, cross over lang tayo dito bandang left and there you have it. Ayan, create new room. Yan mismo yung button ng messenger room. So, click natin. You will be redirected to another window which is ito na po yung messenger room. Yan. Okay. So, zero people. Wala pang nasa room. This is Alan's room. So, akong host nitong messenger room na to. So, join us, Alan. ta -da! Hi, guys. Dito ako. So, ngayon, pwede ko nang gawin dito yung mga meetings ko with my uh, business partners or kung gusto kong makita yung mga relatives ko na mga OFWs or nasa ibang bansa. So, pwede nyo gamitin ito. So, this can accommodate 50 people. So, okay na rin. Marami na rin yun. Mas marami syempre sa Zoom, pero okay lang. At least ito, uh, it's a good alternative na pwede natin gamitin. Now, let me uh, tour you around. So, dito tayo sa my settings, sa my upper right-hand corner. Click natin. So, ito pwede mong i-adjust kung ano yung camera na gusto mo. So, I have a lot of cameras. So, ito na lang Logitech HD Pro webcam ang gamitin ko. Sa microphones, then, then yung mga microphones ko. So, ikaw pwede ka rin mamili ng microphones mo. Then, default speaker. Then, as you can see dito, yung uh, audio wave. Nakikita rin. Then, this one, pag i-click mo yan, maririnig mo yung sarili mo or yung sound ng audio mo. Okay? Then, here also, may mga keyboard shortcuts that you can use. Uh, pwede nyo i-explore uh, ito. And pwede nyo ring i-click itong get help kung merong kayong na-encounter na bugs or whatsoever. Pwede dyan kayo uh, mag-click para ipaalam sa admin ng messenger. Okay, so cancel na na muna natin to. Yan, so yan yung sa settings. Now dito sa baba, this one, we can also share yung ating screen. Okay, so share natin yung ating screen. 
Okay, so dito, ang pwede mong gamitin, you can share your entire screen, a window application, or itong Chrome. Okay. So, siguro, ang pwede nating piliin dito para sa share screen, dito tayo sa application window, ito na lang, meron akong PowerPoint presentation. So, click ko to, and then share screen. Yan, okay, as you can see, nakapag-share screen na ako. So, ang itsura nito sa messenger room is yung ito yung screen. Well, sa mga viewers, sa mga kasama ko, ito yung malaki tong screen na to. Kaya lang, nasa screen ko ngayon eh. So, pag i-click natin yung share screen, papalitan niya yung camera ko. So, ako yung mawawala. Then, ang makikita lang is yung aking uh, PowerPoint presentation. Now, for me to get back, kinakailangan ko nang i-stop yung sharing. Ito, pwede mo i-stop dito or pwede mo i-stop dito. Then, babalik na ako. Yun. <laughs> so, yun po yung share your screen. So, pwede. Well, this one, itong button na to, si call participant. So, click natin. Now, here, uh, dito muna tayo sa people. So, pwede mong i-lock yung room mo. For example, i-share mo yung iyong uh, messenger. I mean, dito muna tayo sa baba. It, itong invite people. So, ito yung gagamitin mong uh, link if you want to invite people to come in your messenger room na ikaw ang host. Now, halimbawa, na-share mo and then uh, na may nabigyan ka na tao na ayaw mong papasukin sa room mo, then pwede mong i-lock yung room. Ayan, pwede mong i-lock. Pag nilock mo yung room, ayan, are you sure you want to lock the room? Pag nilock mo, then yung taong yon kahit na i-click niya nang i-click yung link na binigay mo, hindi siya makakapasok. Okay? So, yun po ang purpose nitong lock room. Okay, so unlock na natin. Then, in this room, syempre, ako lang yun nandito. Pero kapag nandyan na yung mga participants, yung mga in-invite mo, then makikita mo rin sila dito. And, and of course, ito yung kanina sinabi ko, if you want to invite uh, people to go inside your room, then click mo lang tong copy and then i-paste mo lang sa messenger nila. Okay? Then, here naman sa settings, ayan. Ito naman yung end room, ayan. Remove all members and disable link. Meaning to say, pag natapos na kayo sa inyong meeting, then I suggest ito yung puntahan mo, i-end mo dito para lahat kayo mag out Kasi pag ikaw lang yung nag-out, maaaring nasa loob pa rin sila, nag-meeting. <laughs> so, if you want all of you to be out of the room at ma-disable yung link, then ito yung gamitin mo itong end room. So, hindi muna, natin, hindi muna natin gagamitin yan. So, dito, again, you can turn on your video and turn off your video. Yan. And pwede mo ring i-mute yung sarili mo. And lastly, ito, uh, if you want to leave the room, then leave the room. Click mo then the uh, broadcast or itong meeting nyo ends. Kaya lang, ang alam ko, pag hindi nag-leave ng room yung mga participants, nasa room pa rin sila. Kaya ang the best na dapat mong gawin is, dito kang sa settings, and then i-end room mo siya. Okay? So, before I end ko itong room na to, siguro mas maganda kung may makasama ako dito, di ba? Para makita natin kung anong itsura nito. Ang sabi kasi 50 people. Ha? Siguro I can invite maybe 1 to 2 people. So, let's see kung paano. So, give me a few minutes. mag invite lang ako ng makakasama ko dito sa messenger room ko. 1 minute, 37 seconds later. Okay, so nandito na tayo sa messenger. Now, in-invite ko itong business partner ko at mga kaibigan ko na si Ray Pastrana at si Eric Melchor. So, gawa na tayo ng messenger room. Ayan. So, zero people pa. So, papasok na ako para pwede na tayo mag-start ng aking room. Ayun na ako. Hi, guys. <laughs> okay, full screen natin. So, mag-invite na tayo. This is the link. Copy ko na yan. Balik tayo kay Coach Eric at kay Bro Ray. Bigay natin itong link. And, yan, hintay natin sila. Join na kayo. So, let's see what happens. So, dito lang tayo. Wait natin sila mag-pop dito sa ating screen. Okay. At this point, tumabas na sila sa screen ko. So, ngayon, I ask them kung kaya nilang mag-share ng screen nila. Kasi sa Zoom, pwede, kang, pwede yung participant mag-share ng screen. So, I'd like to find out 
kung kaya dito gawin sa messenger room na ang mismong participant ay pwedeng mag-share ng screen. So, let's see kung pwede. So, pwede rin palang mag-share ng screen katulad ng Zoom. So, if you are looking for an alternative sa Zoom video conferencing, then you can use itong Facebook Messenger Room. Ang maganda, it's very easy to use and the best part, it is free. Let me know sa comment section kung nagawa mo itong messenger rooms. I would love to hear from you. And speaking about the comment section, so Friday, ready na ba yung mga nag-comment sa previous videos natin? Ready, Sir mm -hmm. Alan. So, here are the comments of the day. Here are the comments of the day. So guys, huwag kakalimutan mag-subscribe at i-click na rin yung bell notification, pati na rin yung all, para ikaw ang unang-unang mononotify pag meron kaming latest video episodes. Okay, so this is Alan De Leon. Thank you very much for watching. And, and, don't forget to watch the other videos that we have for you. Okay, so bye for now and God bless. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching Alan Online TV. See you in our next video episode.